In this topic, we're just specifically going to talk about, let's say, the atoms and molecules. That in the universe, everything is made of atoms and molecules. Um, the whole, if, if you take a spaceship and go to the outer space, the space between the stars is, is made of atoms and molecules. Now, the, what, what I'm trying to do in here is start with a very simple explanation of, of, uh, of these uh, atoms and molecules. And the simplest atoms and molecule, uh, the simplest atom, which is universal, is, is the hydrogen atom. Hydrogen, every atom has got a positive nucleus center, which is composed of protons, which are positively charged, and electrons, which are negatively charged, and they move around this nucleus like a, um, like a cloud, what is called electronic cloud. So you put the yang and the yin together, so as I said, as we said previously, or, or, or mentioned earlier, when you put yin and yang together, you create energy. So when you put, so the simplest atom, which is the hydrogen, you have energy. So you have yin and yang put together to create energy. Qi. And that is what the Tao talks about. The yin and the yang come together and create energy. The same thing happens when a female egg, yin, combines with a male sperm, yang, and creates energy, creates life. So this represents, at the atomic level, represent the Tao. So this is the Tao. Tao is everywhere. God is everywhere. So you put the yin and the yang together and you create life. And, and in, in death, the yin and the yang separate. And that separation of yin and yang is death. And the combination of yin and yang is life. This principle happens day and night. Seasons. The, the theory of creation of Big Bang. Everything that you look at is the Tao in it. It's a yin and the yang. From a simplest atomic level right to the most complicated um, creation, which is human beings, it's got this yin and yang. Because we all have this within us. With this, without this hydrogen, we can't live. And this starts from a very simple level and builds up and builds up and it gets more complicated which we're going to talk about it uh, a bit more. So if you look at again as a battery, I don't want to advertise, this but we know what this is anyway, this is a battery. The battery has got a duality, a yang positive and a negative at the bottom here. So when this battery works is the energy that flows between the yin and the yang, from the yin back to yang, back to yin, back to yang. That's how it creates energy. So we are like this battery. We create, we are, we are energy. So what is happening also is between the nucleus of the atom and the electron, there is a, there is a gap, there is a space. It's, a, it's empty space, it's void. So the electrons not only kind of uh, rotate on the itself, it goes round in this electronic cloud. In this electronic cloud, it goes round.